So, many believers ask questions like, why is it so difficult to pray? Amen. Why do I feel tired when I want to pray? Why do I feel reluctant to pray? What makes praying or prayer very difficult? What makes me feel heavy every time I want to pray? Praise God. Praise God. Now, the Lord gave me this word to answer that question. So I'm going to share three points with you. Why believers feel reluctant in prayer or why they feel exhausted to pray. Every time a believer wants to pray, that is when sleep comes. That is when distraction comes. That is when he feels suddenly, he feels tired, you know, and all of that. So there are reasons why it happens that way. Now, the first thing is that the flesh of man does not want prayer. Amen. It's very important for us to understand how the flesh operates, how the flesh behaves. Praise God. The key to handling any situation is the right understanding of what is going on. Until you understand why things happen around you, it may be difficult to solve them. And so many people feel they feel very very exhausted, feel you know tired, they feel overwhelmed to pray. One of the reasons is because your body does not want prayer. Your flesh does not want prayer. Listen to what the Bible says in Galatians chapter 5 and verse 17. The Bible says, For the flesh lusts against the spirit, and the spirit against the flesh. And these are contrary to one another, so that you do not do the things that you wish. The flesh is contrary to the spirit. And the spirit is contrary to the flesh. In other words, the body, the flesh does not want what the spirit wants. And the spirit does not want what the flesh wants. They are contrary. They don't work together. They don't agree together. Prayer is a spiritual activity. Prayer is a spiritual exercise. So the body and the flesh does not want it. I will tell you what the flesh wants. The flesh wants food. The flesh wants pleasure. Now, if you talk about movie, people could sit down and watch movies for hours on end. Two movies, three, four, five movies. They are not tired. Okay, that's what the flesh wants. Someone can sit with a friend and just for, you know, two hours and even more. They are not tired. But so many believers, once it's time to pray, give them five minutes and they are already tired. The reason is because Prayer is a spiritual exercise, is a spiritual activity, and the flesh becomes a barrier because the flesh does not want what the spirit wants. It's important to understand this in order to overcome the challenge of prayerlessness. We must understand that prayer is not what the body wants naturally. So we have to trust God to help us to that place where we can pray when it's time for prayer. And your body is resisting it is normal the body will not want you to pray because the body is contrary to the spirit but as you begin to pray as you advance in prayer the more you pray the more your spirit becomes alive and the more you can pray so do not let the flesh the first barrier which is the flesh stop you from praying but if you just give up and say oh I don't feel like praying I'm tired I don't feel like praying. I feel sleepy. I don't feel like praying. I'm exhausted. The truth is you will not be able to pray. So that is the first challenge and that is the first reason why prayer seems very difficult.